Hey guys, uh, Rich here at RC Informer. I got Steve on the camera as usual, and we got uh, we got Gavin. He's gonna fly the airplane today. I'm gonna fly it around a little bit. But we're at the Moonport Modelers Club. Steve, you want to film around? We come out here in the mornings, or this is my first time I've been here, and uh, so uh, we're gonna fly a little bit out here. And Gavin's gonna take the sticks on the otter to try it out, and. Uh, all right, and we got the otter. I just got the floats back on. We were Imperial, at Imperial RC last weekend, and I just slapped the floats on last night, and I'm just making sure everything's good to go. The uh, floats went back on easy with the water rudder hookup and everything. Reckonroy's RC wanted me to tell you he said hi. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see him on the chat sometimes. Let me check the flaps and stuff. Tell him, tell we're good. him I said hi, and I was like, okay, I will. All right. I think we're good. You ready, Steve? That's it. Right, let's go. We're at mid rates on. Get wet. All right, here. Let's go. Oh man, how long have you guys been flying off the water here? Actually, flying off many, many years, but we just kind of revamped it just again this year. Just okay. Two or three months, probably. All right, one small step for man. Well, there we go. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's test this out. You got that mic on, Steve? Yep. All right, cool. Let's see what we got here. Here, come on over. <laughs> All right, right, left, up, down. We're good. I'm just going to go with 100% rates on it for right now. Wow, I didn't really... This is a huge area of water here, isn't it? Wow. Take it off. Yeah, this one bounces a little bit. Let's see if we're all trimmed up and everything. I got full flaps in here. You probably use use flaps much. This thing will really crawl with flaps in. Yeah, it, it'll it'll get really slow with full flaps. Yeah, it's smooth as glass. It's weird flying in a corner. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just trying to get used to the. The area here, because we're not really on a on a downwind or a upwind. Let me go to a higher rate on everything. And this thing will fly like all day. I got a 3200 uh, Smart Lipo in there, and it'll go like all day. Oh, sorry, Steve. Uh, I think I was just getting it slow. I mean, I don't think, I think it was just me. But you can see how it's pretty snappy. Whoa! Something's up with that. What the heck? That was weird. That was great for the video. I don't what know what it was. About? No, I was full forward on the stick. I don't know why I was doing that. It flies upside down fine normally. That was weird. I mean, I had to stick to the stop. That was strange. And I've done it a thousand times with this plane, so I don't know why. Oh, well. Whoa! Did it again! <laughs> Rich, almost crashes inverted. That's right. 
Let's see. Yeah, it might be me. But yeah, it flies nice and smooth. It'll fly a long time. All right, let's see if I can do a landing, Steve, without breaking anything today. Are you ready? No. Uh oh, cabin's on the sticks. Watch out. Yeah, that's uh, yeah, that's up. That's mid. They usually take off with that, but you don't have to. And then see this right here. This is your that's your high aileron rate. That's medium and that's low. I was using high, and that's high elevator, medium. I think the reason I had the problem is I was in I was in like a mid rate for elevator, and I I mean I was full for. Don't you have to do all that stuff? Don't go crazy with it. Just have fun oh, yeah, with it. Have yeah. fun, and then when you get comfortable with it, kind of do what you want with it, you know. So. There you go. Yeah, this thing, this thing bounces a bit. I don't know. I don't know what it is to take off and landing. You got to really finesse it to do a smooth takeoff and landing. So it just. You can do it, but. Um, But it's just got a, it's got a long, thin, high aspect ratio wing. It's more like a glider. So the endurance is on it really, is really good. So if you're flying it like, um, um, if you're modulating the throttle, you'll get 10 to 15 minutes of flying out of this thing, you know? It'll, it'll go a long, long way. Probably sleeping for four hours doesn't help. <laughs> No, it's okay. No, you're good. You're good. We're just having fun. I mean, it's just... Well, what do you think? I like it. Is it neat? I mean, it's a... Uh, it's a little different flying with a different type of radio. I think it's a... Uh, yeah, it's a cool... Uh, I think you ought to get Gavin the airplane. Well, what do you fly? Uh, I have my F-16 over there today. No, 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 no. Well, you said a different radio. Yeah. Right? Oh. I mean, do you have Spectrum or... Yeah, I have a Spectrum. Yeah. Okay, it's an 8, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, it's, I mean, it's basically the same radio. I mean, it... I mean, does it feel about the same? You say it feels different? Yeah, the radio is just like holding it in my hand. Okay, all right. I agree, I don't think he has a I mean, everybody plane. here in the club has got Gavin going by giving him a kind of airplane. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, I gave him a hat and shirt last weekend. <laughs> Right. Okay. Add Imperial RC Club. But yeah, it's cool. And then you know, you saw it. I think fly on the on the gear and all that stuff too. So I mean, you could switch that out real easy. It's uh. Um, Dead. What's that? Paul thing or he's doing that. I think he's doing it. Uh, I tell you what, why don't you land it out front? Let me do a quick battery check and we'll see where it's at. I'd guess it's maybe at like 40% left or something. You run a four cell in there? It's a three. Three cell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's just, you just got to judge where the ground, yeah, where the water is. You'll see the, actually you got a good reflection there, so that's perfect. There you go, nice. Nice. Here, bring it on over. Let's see. We may still keep flying. Let me see where the battery's at. To fall in here. There we go. And then I got a throttle kill. Right here. Yeah. Yeah, so don't hit that switch when you're flying. Here, let me <laughs> let me look at this real quick. Let's see what we got. I tell you what, let me bring it over here. And if we got some left, we'll keep going. Let's see how we're doing here. It's low thick already. Yeah, we put some CA and blender on it. Those are hard. 
Can you get on there? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Stay right there. We're moving. 11%. Oh, 36%. I'm sorry. Yeah, 36. Here, go do a couple takeoffs and landings with it. There we go. Let's see. You guys going back up? Yeah, just for a little bit. Yeah, we're just going to kind of go. Throw one air in the water. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, no, you're fine. Yeah, you can, you can go. You're all good. Just having fun here. I'll give it a second. Let it boot up. And this is the, uh, yeah, got the too. That was weird when I went inside and I pushed on it. I was like, what's it doing? <laughs> I think it was my rate. You ready to go? Yep. Right. Here we go. Uh, I have problems with my airplane. You want me to shoot? I got my, my bad shoes. Oh, no, I'm good. That's good. These are my kind of water resistant shoes, so. Yeah, yeah you're good, yeah. Did you see the feel the nose dip just a little tiny bit there? Yeah, I mean, uh, what you saw in the video it was a little more, because I think I just got it too slow when I did it, so, yeah. Yeah, do, do a couple landings or touch and go, whatever, yeah, yeah, see if you can do a couple of, uh, There you go. That's all right. I, I'm not used to water. <laughs> Remember I told him it bounces? <laughs> no, he's so good. You're, no, you're not doing anything we all hadn't done with that thing. <laughs> Steve, you're up next, man. All right. Watch what he's doing. There you go, yeah. Oh my yeah. Just take your time with it. You know, no worries. No, 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 just just kind of. Like, okay, I'm there. Flare. And then I'm yeah, there. yeah. It's judging where the water is, and before you had a really good sil uh, a really good reflection, so just slow it up a little bit. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. He's back. He's, there you go. There you go. Yeah. Nice. There you go. Probably one more, and actually, the next one, let's make it a landing, because we were at 35% before, so why don't you bring it in here, and we'll, we'll get a battery in there for Steve, so. Steve hadn't flown this on the water yet. There you go. Yeah, yeah. That was the first time he ever flew it, though. So, Steve, you want to go next? Sure. Let me put a battery in here, and uh, I got a brand new battery for you to fly it with, so, yeah. There you go. There you go. Awesome, man. So what do you think? It flies really nice. Yeah, it's cool, isn't it? Yeah, not it's pretty power. awesome. It's not overpowered. Yeah, it sounds good. good. It's quiet. It's got lights, all that stuff. All right, Steve, you ready? Let's hit it. All right, you're up. Cool. <laughs> okay, Steve, we're on. Hey. You ready to go? Time to go flying. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Steve's turn. He's had this on the, he's flown this on the, the wheels, but not yet. Not yet the uh, float, so we'll see how that goes. There you go. Perfect. Excellent. Now let me get uh, get my eyepiece thing going. You want to fly the Havoc again? Steve, are you filming with the eyepiece or the viewfinder? What do you use? You use the eyepiece, don't you? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. All right, guys, I'll try to give you a smooth ride here. <laughs> yeah, hope so. <laughs> me too. This is kind of weird in the corner here, Steve, yeah. too. It's just kind of different, but... All right, taking off. There you go. Oh, I was trailing to the right. I'm there. already jiggling the camera around. Trying to smooth it out here. There you go. Coming back at you. There we 
go. Pan out just a little bit. Joe said they're no good. All right. What do you think, Steve? Ah, she's flying smooth still. Yeah, so nice and smooth. So I can get a little touch and go in here. Yep, yeah, close. Going around, yeah, that's all right. That's why in the corner it's weird because you can't, you know, you got to get it down kind of earlier or you're in the trees over there. <laughs> Definitely different flying in the corner of the lake here. So, say okay, there's a nice background back there. The sun's hitting everything nice now. Nice touch and go. Very good, Steve. All right, guys, rate me on my filming performance. I'm <laughs> getting better at it, I think. Let me see what I can do this way. Well, I'm fully zoomed in, and I'm keeping track of it, so. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little deceiving in this. Yeah, it is very. It's weird in the corner, man. It's kind of screwing me up a little bit. You probably got to approach from like where you are now and just get it, you know, just get it down as early as you can and let it slow down. There you go. Once you hit the water, it stops. Yeah, I mean, it slows down very quick. You guys can see over here, that's the end of the, <laughs> there's a bunch of bushes over there. And so you got to sort of, we're in the corner of the lake again, not the, not the downwind, not the upwind or the. Got a right dry when it's out yeah. in the water. I don't know why, but must be a rudder. Maybe try like a setting of flaps on takeoff. That should get it up there a little quicker. Well, all those flights are zero flaps, so. Uh, yeah, that's what that's what I figured. Yeah, if you use a little flap, it'll get it up there a little sooner. Because when you do, uh, when you get the high speed taking off like that, you tend to snag a float a little more. So yeah, there you go. You're good. You can. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, nice, nice, yeah. That's great, Steve. Perfect. Looks good. It's a half flap takeoff here. Let's see what happens. Yeah. I got three there. Yeah, you get to a point where it bounces, <laughs> you just kind of pull back on the stick and get it off the water, yeah. That handle's nice. It's still uh, even on the water. It's... Yeah. Yeah, nice. Very yeah, cool. Let's go down here and do a full flap. So, see how slow we can go here. Yeah, it'll it'll full really flaps. crawl. Very nice, very nice. Okay, taking off. Yep, oh. yep, that, oh. <laughs> that'll happen. Yeah, sorry. That changed the definition of prop wash. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it'll Bounce get into that oscillation. oscillation a little bit, yeah. Nice. Very good. Half flap take off. See if I can keep it straight this time. There you go. A bit better. Yep. I think I'll do a couple more takeoffs and landings with it too. Probably when you when you feel like you're done with it. I may do a couple with it just to Nice. Very cool. Crash and dash. That's all right. <laughs> yes, sir. It's all good, man. I'm going to let the uh, rudder for a minute. That's what it looks like it's doing. I think the wind, I think it's a little windy. It's like a little bit of wind for this thing. My 
buddy lost one of these a little way. They went away and he couldn't get it to come back. It goes pretty good down the list. Nice, Steve. Very nice. Excellent. Steve, I think I'm getting a little smoother on the camera now. <laughs> well, the viewers will let you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they all always give me crap about that. Fire the cameraman! You yeah. know, stuff like that. Full flap to a full stop. Nice, Steve. I think if, if you're cool with it, Steve, I'll probably switch off and let me do a couple landings. Is that good? Yeah. Here. All right, bring it on in, bring it on in. No, no, no I'll just give it to you right now. You want to just switch? Yeah. All right, here. I think you got enough battery. All right, I got you fully panned out. I'll give you that. Oh, man, this is a mid-flight camera swap. We've never there done this. <laughs> this is getting fancy now. There you go. Rich is on the sticks. Here we go. Build a canal. What do you think, Steve? Nice, though? Oh, yeah. I mean, it's a pretty sweet model. I mean, it's uh, Drives good, handles good. Just so I know when to taxi or when you when you taxi now, it's got a lot of right turn to it. So. Yeah, it's the water the right rudder way. is not a perfect thing on this plane. <laughs> Take it off directly away from you so you yeah. can see what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, I'll uh And you got it you gotta really get it slow for the water rudder to work well. Take it off. See? Yeah. Okay, I didn't know you shouldn't come that close. Sorry. <laughs> All right, let me, uh, uh, let's see if I can do a couple landings with it decently. That's not bad. Nope, that was pretty. Hey, could I do bother you to get a couple with mine? Could you snap a few pictures with my phone too? Would you mind doing that? Is that cool? I'll just hand it to you. Just, uh, yeah. Awesome, thanks. Just me and Steve, the plane, just whatever you can get, you know. A couple of mine and I'll send you over. Okay, cool, yeah, no, thank you, yeah. I'm gonna turn it around here, Steve, here we go. You got a kind of a downwind now. Here, go ahead. Steve. 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 Yeah. Steve. Yeah. Steve, give me a smile. Here, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I have my camera set up to take widescreen pictures. Yeah, I'm. I'm not so, bad. so, and, and the reason I do that is because I use a lot of that for thumbnails and stuff. So. Oh wait, hang on. Let me get. Uh, I got too much flap in there. Take it off. Here, I'll come by slow this way. Maybe you can get a... I'll bring it by nice and slow here. The wind's starting to pick up a little bit here. No, I'm, I'm being real careful, so... Were you able to get anything there? Or yeah. Of the plane? Yeah. It's... A lot of times we got to get really close in stuff for pictures, so. Yeah. yeah whenever you want, uh, you can throw it in the back of the truck there. I'll, uh... All right, Steve, let's see if... Uh... I got about a third throttle in here. That's nice. Yeah, that's pretty. See, Steve, I don't bounce them all in. Look at that. <laughs> Ooh. Got that on tape. You notice here, as soon as I slow the plane down and give it rudder, it turns better. Yeah, like at high speed, it doesn't turn that great. All right, here we go. Take it off.
when they did the full conversions on these, they just put them out. All right, another landing here. Full flaps, about a third throttle. You touch and go it, there we go. Let me try one from the other side here. Try to avoid the, the weeds at the end there. Okay, let me go around again, hang on. Something was distracting me there. <laughs> I'm going to kind of come out of a turn if I can here. And Oops, a little harder than I want. There we go. We made it though. <laughs> Taking off. It's a nice little field here. Yep. All right, let me bring it on in, Steve. I think that's uh, good. I got bugs crawling all over me, though. Here, let's see. Here we go. A little power coming in. Yeah, let me do another one here. See, I was full rudder, and it wasn't until it slowed down that it turns. All right, here we go. Yeah, we got the sunlight on it now. All right, we will end it with that. Ready? That is a cool plane. It just looks great with those darn props. All right, Steve, thanks for filming, guys. Thanks for watching. Check our links below. Like and subscribe. Come to Moonport Modelers. Everybody's here flying. Anything to say, Steve? You like this thing, isn't this cool? Oh, it's cool, cool, cool plane. Yeah, nice Especially plane. Especially twins on the water, that's great. Yeah, the flights go, the floats go on and off pretty nice, pretty easy, and it's a good flyer. So uh, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you all next time. <laughs>